How's it going YouTube? Dan the Plastic Man here. Hope you guys are doing well. Time to take a look at the plates of the Tri-Burning Gundam. First and foremost, we'll get the non-really labeled stuff out of the way. Here are the foil seals. I'll see how many of these I can skip. I mean, it's only four and I've got enough markers and paint that I should be able to get around this. Here is the polycap tree. Pretty small, so hopefully shouldn't be too hard to work with. Now, on to the effect parts, which are aptly numbered EF3, get that fully out of frame, EF4, which is more for the standard flames, and is actually, I was going to say very soft, but no broken pieces, it's just that the tree itself just snapped. So EF4 out of the way, and EF5, which is more for the burning burst system. Now onto the plates for the actual suit itself. Here's the A plate, and this is going to be inner frame gray, lots of hands, and B plate is external white armor. Here's the side skirts, there's the thighs, front skirts, ankles, that looks like the top of the feet. C plate is red, external armor, so here's the feet. Uh, let's see, what else can I pick out here? That's part of the chest right there. D plate is navy blue, and this is for the stomach joint. That's the groin right there. E is just two yellow pieces. You've got the V fin, and then the chest vents. G plate is more external white armor. You've got the legs, knees, here's the arms, and here's the face mask. And finally, the H plate is clear blue plastic, and this is all the normal mode effect parts. So we've got the backpack, these are pieces that I think go inside the knee, there's the side skirts. So all in all, I'm really looking forward to putting this suit together. So if you guys like this video, leave me a like, subscribe, leave me some comments, I love reading them. And take care of yourselves guys, I will see you at the next video. Bye bye.